Jim Wacker Field at Bobcat Stadium here in San Marcos, opened in 1981 and home to the Texas State University Bobcats. And now it's time for the coin toss, and it's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. Both teams have sent their special teams out of the field, and we're ready for the opening kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. And they push him out at the 31. North Texas offense, a lot of times they can spread things out and they can really be versatile offensively. But when you've got a wide receiver like this, it really helps the coach. Well, it does, and it, and it continues to help with what they're trying to do. They're trying to find matchups. And when you have one player like this that the defense has got to be aware of, they're going to spread you out, try to find the one-on-one -on -one matchup. And if you spend too much time with this one player, they've got some other weapons to make you pay for it. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz, and a quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. Dumps it complete over the middle. Tackle made at the 48. Not a bad little play there. Yeah, this is a nice job by the quarterback reading the coverage and delivering a very catchable ball and allowing his receiver to come up with a nice game. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. So he keeps it, and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. On the run. He fights forward to about the 39. Rose and it's knocked away. Well defended that time. You're right. Great job here by the defender playing the ball, keeping his balance and getting in the way of that pass. So it's fourth down. They call on the kicker for a long field goal. He gets it up and it's long enough. And he just drilled it from long range. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He's to the 20. Tackle made at the 26-yard line. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. And he can't get away from the pressure. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. They found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. Second down and 17. Ball on their own 19. Running. And he's tackled right away. Gets it out quickly. He's to the 40. And he shoved out of bounds at the 47-yard line. That's just a well-executed screen pass. They had the blockers in front, and they got it to him with room to run. They bring him down. You can't take sacks like that as a quarterback. You just can't. If you can't find a receiver, get out of the pocket and throw the ball away. From their own 40-yard line. Second down. Here's a handoff up the middle and no room to run. And the halfback's got nowhere to go. Run! 
Aaron and out long. Huge gain, and that sets him up nicely with a first and goal. Touchdown, Bobcats. There are some guys, when they get near the goal line, they just have a knack for getting the ball into the end zone. That's what we saw right there. And he adds the extra point. A nice seven-play, 73-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. He's to the 20. He's taken down at the 26. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Fires quick to an open man. He dropped it. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 26. So the halfback gets some decent yards and a first down. He got seven, but it looked like for a second he could have broken it for even more. Good call. Makes the grab and steps out right away. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Here's a screen to the wideout, and he's taken down at the 42-yard line. Number 16 makes the tackle at the 42-yard line. That brings him second and five. They'll bring him down at the 35. Makes the catch. That's a game of seven on the play. First down. Tries to get around the corner. Runs right for a nice game. That's a deal of four. That makes it second and six. From the 31 yard line, it's second down. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. He's got it with room to run. Tackle right around the 20. That's a gain of six on the play. First down. Roger, Roger. Mike 18, Mike 18. Come on, baby, come on, baby. Woo! Go! Shift, shift. Good open field tackle. They try to run up the middle, but met in the backfield.
So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. He splits the uprights with the extra point. North Texas is ready to kick it away. It's fielded at the two. He makes it to the 25-yard line. I love the competitive spirit that we're seeing out on this field today. It looks like one team has the upper hand, and then the other comes right back in to be able to regain the lead. It's going to be an exciting finish. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. You can bet this defense made some adjustments on the sideline, though. I don't know if they can stop the passing attack, but they need to at least be able to slow it down. So at the end of one, North Texas leads it 10-7. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Grabs it and hammered right there. They come out on an empty backfield. He's taken down at the 33. Pretty good defense there on the option. They'll stop him for a loss of one. Down a bound at the 36. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. North Texas has a three-point lead. He's tackled at the 46-yard line. That'll make it second and inches. Play action. He'll scramble. Quick throw. And down he goes at about the 49. That makes it first and 10. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. the stop at the 49-yard line. Well, the defensive line got such a good push up front that there was no one on the offense to account for the linebacker. And he got through almost untouched. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 41. Slings it. And he's tackled right around the 38-yard line. First down. Five wide. Looks to the back and can't connect. From the 38-yard line, it's second down. He gets out to about the 35-yard line. North Texas is up by three. With the pass incomplete. Just flung it out there, and it was short. Uh, he got a little bit lazy here. There's no question. He should be able to make that throw nine out of ten times. That was the one time he missed it. Fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit. It has the distance, and he splits the uprights. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. 
He's to the 20. And he's tackled at the 26-yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He's out of bounds right around the 28-yard line. out of bounds at the 31 yard line call the game three yards that'll make it 35 quick pass and he's level at the 39 it out to maybe the 39-yard line. He goes out of bounds at the 41. Here they come, and he is drilled at the 33-yard line. Loss of eight yards on the play. That makes it fourth and long. The sack makes this a fourth and very long. Gets to about the 41-yard line. North Texas's team, when you look at them, I think they got to be happy with how versatile they can be because they do have a star that is not having a star-type game right now, and yet they got the lead here, and we're almost at halftime. Yeah, I think they've really shown their versatility as an offense. Uh, to think that we would be sitting here close to this first half being over and to see that their go-to wide receiver is not putting up these big numbers, and yet they still have the lead, just tells you a lot about their coaching, the in-game adjustments, and the way the rest of the teammates, this receiver, stepped up. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Halfback's got it on a quick throw. He's at the 40. Tackle made at the 29-yard line. I think the big thing for a defense when they face a screen is chasing it from the inside out, which means the defensive linemen are the key to slowing down a really well-executed screen pass. Because if you think about it, the offensive linemen are getting downfield blocking against the linebackers and the safeties. The defensive linemen have got to be able to recognize screen and then have the quickness to be able to chase the running back down from behind before he gets his momentum going and can outrun him. North Texas, up six. Halfback screen, incomplete. So it's third down, and they're just inches away from picking up the first down. Now he pitches it. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. First down. Catches it, and he's looking for more. And he's taken down at the six-yard line. That brings up second and one. Caught end zone for the touchdown. Converts the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20. They'll bring him down at the 25-yard line. Their last drive broke down, and they punted. 
What do they have in store this time out? Quick strike to the receiver. They'll bring him down at the 30-yard line. The Bobcats taking their first time out of the half. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 30. He gets hit out of bounds at the 30. No game. And he makes it out to about the 31 yard line. The defense punches them off the field after just three plays. That was a short round, Brad. Nothing seems to be working right now. Brought down at the 46. North Texas put themselves in a great position now as they head into the second half. Well, in the first half, we saw a lot of big playability and just a lot of just an explosive approach by this offense. But remember, we'll see what happens here in the second half. This is a long way from being right over. Here, right here. This offense did really well with the air attack on their last trip out there. Let's see if they can do the same thing here. Well, it's one thing to have speed. It's another thing to have an idea of what you're doing and how to attack the defense. And right now, these wide receivers clearly have done an outstanding job of being able to make their reads and getting out of their breaks and the quarterback put the ball right on the mark. Just throws this one away. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 43-yard line. Caught and he's brought down quickly. He's looking for six. In and out of his hands. Starting the intended receiver on the play. That makes it fourth and four. Fourth down. They call on the kicker for a long field goal. He gets it up, and it's long enough. And they come away empty-handed. And our score, 20-7, to North Texas. We're about set to start things up again. got it and they hit him in the backfield loss of about two they really just didn't have any room to work on that play the defense just suffocated him there i guess he'll throw this one as far as he can and hope for a miracle he lets it fly no incomplete we played a half of football here north texas has got a 13 point lead We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. North Texas coaching staff will go out tonight, and I think the offensive coordinator should buy the defensive coordinator his meal. Well, the defense has been great. There's no doubt about it. But I just think that the offense that they're facing, it's just been so conservative, so predictable. It's made it very easy for this defense to have a dominant game. Here he goes. Gains his way to the 33-yard line. They pick up seven or eight yards on the option. That makes it seven to two. Here we go. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. Tackle around the 49-yard line. He looked pretty cool back there. Even with the outside linebacker blitzing, he made an accurate throw, and the result is a new set of downs. Goes right, picked off. 
It's the safety who's in the right place at the right time. The quarterback has to know where the safety is when he makes this kind of throw. Right here, he just tried to force something that wasn't there. From their own 39-yard line, first down. Herbie, this guy headed to the locker room a little bit earlier with that injury. We don't know how bad it is, but right now it doesn't look like he's likely to play any more football. Here's the halfback on the screen. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. No game. That makes it second and ten. Mike 18, Mike 18. It's out. It's out. Makes the catch, and he's got nowhere to go. hit before it could go anywhere. Here's a screen pass. Gets it to the back. And they push him out right around the 30. That's good for a gain of 21 yards. First down. Brought down at about the 21. Number 16 brings him down at the 21 yard line. That makes it second and two. Red two. Orange three. Quick throw, and he's got his man again. What a play to set him up with a first and goal. That makes it first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Two down, two down. Mike 18, Mike 18. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's move, 20. Quick throw, caught, touchdown. on the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 26. The Bobcats have just gone ice cold on offense. They can't seem to get anything going. Yeah, and right now, they just have to forget the score, forget the clock. Just go out there and try to get a first down. Try to hope to build a little bit more confidence and continuity on this offense. Quarterback couldn't maintain possession on their last drive. Let's see what he does here. The first rule on offense is to take care of the football. These guys need to remember that on this drive. Out of bounds around the 30-yard line. Third and five. Ball on the 48-yard line. Here we go. Red 18. Red 18. He steps out at about the 47-yard line. And they could really put their opponent in bad field position with a good punt here.
This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. Six points and a pretty display of passing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense to take a different approach here? When this quarterback is on, he is on. It already seems like whatever this defense is trying just isn't working. But maybe if they add just a little bit more pressure, then they might be able to force him into a mistake. That's good for the game, 55 yards. First down. 18, Mike, 18. I got you, son. I got you, son. Throws it in a hurry. He's taken down at the 11-yard line. Good job here by the receiver to look the ball in and ensure he had possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. Looks left, finding his tailback. He's tackled at about the nine-yard line. Watch two, watch two. That makes it second and eight. The defender had it and then dropped it. I'm not sure the quarterback saw him when he was getting ready to pass because he stuck his paw right in the passing lane. Third down, eight yards to go. Nine yards to the goal line. He gets rid of this one. It's up, and it is good. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. He's tackled at the 28. Let's see if this drive has a more rewarding conclusion than their last, which ended with a punt. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. And he just gets rid of it. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 28. Man, watch out here. And he's tackled right around the 38-yard line. I'm not sure if the back was his first option, but he got in the ball, and he was able to make something big happen. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That's good for a game of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. He'll get it again. Runs it left for a decent game. Caught with room to work. He's at the 30, and he's shoved out of bounds around the 28-yard line. Great touch by the quarterback. Flowing that one right into his hands. That takes some skill. Now he tries to buy some time. And down he goes at the 28-yard line. No game on the play. That makes it second and ten. He throws left. Looks to the end zone and it's caught. Touchdown. This guy just continues to impress me. Every time I watch this team play, he seems to come up with big plays. Well, they're going to try for the two-point conversion. Under heavy pressure. He's in for the score, and they're back in it. Number 
They line up to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. And down he goes at the 26-yard line. North Texas's offense has just been dominant here in the third quarter, and it's got to be pretty demoralizing for the defense. Yeah, the defense, I mean, they just have to get some kind of stop here to be able to get some confidence and be able to get their own offense into a position and being able to put some points up. But right now, they just cannot stop this high-powered attack. And they make the stop at the 29. It's not over yet, folks. We head to the fourth quarter. North Texas up by 15. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. made around the 36 yard line game of seven on the play first down he was pretty quiet he was pretty quiet mike 18 mike 18 tackle that reducing pickup good for a game of six yards that brings him second and five Gets to about the 44-yard line. Caught open field. Steps out of bounds at the 44. That'll make it fourth and two. Rodriguez to punt. He makes it to the 28-yard line. They got into the end zone last time. Let's see if they can match that on this possession. it all. Great catch and he's out of bounds. First down and they've got their eyes on that goal line. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Touchdown, Bobcats. Great job of finding the space to run and just bursting in for six. And they're looking to get two points here. Get 
two. A seven play, 73 yard drive. And they'll come away with six points after failing on the two point conversion. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown drive. Tackle made at the 43 yard line. And what a game it's been for this quarterback, Kirk. Well, this is really just one of those games where it's all coming together. He's making the right reads, he's delivering the football in rhythm. And the most important thing is he's playing with confidence. And the crowd's been neutralized by his performance. So that's one more positive for these guys. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. They go to the run, and he's tackled in the backfield for a loss. That makes it second and ten. It's second and ten. Ball on the 43. Just over two minutes in the game. Gets to about the 41-yard line. Texas State's going to use their first time out of the half here. Throws in a hurry. Huge gain, and that sets him up nicely with a first and goal. Texas State will take a timeout. That's their second of the half. North Texas already with a two-score lead, and they can add to it here with first and goal. Got a man open. Touchdown. that this isn't huge. The game's not quite over, but boy, have they put themselves in a great spot. So the kicker's going to stay on the sidelines. These guys will try for a two-point conversion. He's got it for two. As his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They punched it in for six on the last series. Can they do it again? This quarterback right now is in a rhythm, and a lot of that has to do with his preparation. You can see right now with the reads that he's being able to make, getting the football out of his hands, that he's feeling very, very confident in his ability to throw the football against this defense. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 25. Quick shot to the open receiver, and he can't hang on to the ball. Just under two minutes in the game. Throws it to the halfback on the screen. Tackle at about the 37-yard line. He goes downtown. Missed him. Boy, the defender was just sitting back there waiting to make that big hit. He realized he couldn't get there for the interception, so he did the next best thing. He timed up his hit by the time the quarterback threw the football. As soon as the receiver touched the football, he made that big hit to be able to get the football away from the receiver. Brought down at about the 43-yard line. Short over the middle. He's taken down at about the 45. Well, they didn't need much, so give it up to the defense for reading that one and making a sensational stop to keep them short of the first down. Looks like they've decided to go for it here. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. He goes out of bounds around the 48-yard line. Here's the eighth play of the series. Connect. 
So it's second and ten. Ball on the 48. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. This is the 10th play of this drive. Just over a minute in the fourth quarter. Go. He's tackled at the 44-yard line. Goes a laser across the middle, and he's tackled at the 34 yard line. Thirteenth play of the drive coming up. That makes it second and ten. Thirty-four's the mic. Thirty-four's the mic. He's coming. Check him. Check him. Let's go. And here's a quick throw. Balls it in as he's pushed out of bounds. From the 19 yard line. First down. Rose. Couldn't haul it in. That looked like the same play they just called. Yeah, it was. The defense was ready for it this time. This is play number 15 of a very impressive drive. He's out of bounds around the 14-yard line. From the 14-yard line, it's third down. And a quick throw. He delivers. Well, you can talk about offense all you want, and they were good today, but the defense was better. They come up with a play of the day, and that'll lead to the victory. North Texas's team right now aware that they are a team. Hey, they're starting to shine today. That's Everybody else picked up the pace, the though. I think we all came in expecting really? to see that star player really shine. And, and the fact and that they didn't have a great game from him and still won the football game, boy, I walk away from this game as a viewer just thinking even that much more about this team than maybe what I thought prior to the football game.